Hey guys, what's up? My name is Prez, and welcome to another episode of NHL Be a Pro, episode 54. I believe it's number 54. If it's not 54, then I feel pretty goddamn awful that it's not number 54. I'm currently checking, as I'm talking to you guys, to actually make sure it's actually episode 54. Yes, it is. It's actual episode 54. But anyways, we're playing, we're playing against the LA Kings. Hope you guys enjoy the video. I'll see you guys when we get on the ice. All right, hey guys, we're on the ice, and I accidentally summoned it through the second period, but I am sorry about that. But tomorrow's episode would definitely include the second period. It's just I've been a little bit uh, tired lately, like I said in like the last couple of videos. I don't know, I've just been really, really tired. I haven't been really motivated to actually make uh, videos anymore. I don't know why. I haven't uploaded to the Prez Original. Um, all I've been doing is just uploading to this channel. I'm trying to create like a new series for this channel where I can kind of take a like I during the week like when I'm done recording NHL be a pro let's just say if I record like two three episodes I just I just chill out for those two three days I don't even play NHL at all for those two or three days that I am actually not playing and because uh, I already uploaded I already made two videos but if I don't if I play it every single night then I get bored of it and uh, I hate getting bored of game like this game I got around this time I actually been bored of NHL 15 around this time and it's awful and it's awful I hate that feeling where I play a game every single night basically I play Halo and I don't get bored of Halo because I grew up playing that game religiously like I played that every single night of my life and for the past eight years I've been playing that game but I play and like I never really played NHL like I do in the last couple of years like I never really played NHL like this ever it's uh it's a first for me so to get bored of this game it's kind of hard it's it's really hard to get bored of this game um but when you make like 54 videos of this game in just the same series and just in the same mode it's it's really tough to come up with new ideas to talk about and uh new thumbnails and all that stuff it's really hard to come up with that type of stuff and it's actually one of the hardest parts for this is to make the video entertaining and to make the video much longer and to make a thumbnail for this video would you not believe it to actually make a thumbnail for this video is actually one of the hardest things to do and to actually come up with topics and talk about them and see if topics you guys are interested in and um, I know some people say you could you could talk whatever you talk whatever you want about like whatever you want to talk about you could guy you could talk about and obviously I could do that I could do that it's just, I don't really want to do that I really want to talk about the game but it's really hard to talk about the game as it's going on I'm not going to give you every single detail like oh Prince Bravo passes it up to Cindy Crosby and Cindy Crosby passes it up to uh, Melkin and whatever and Crosby and Melkin passes it off to Kessel I'm not going to give then Kessel shoots and misses with a I'm not going to give you like full on stats while I'm playing the game because that's one of that's really hard to do first of all and I'm actually, I'm not an analyst of NHL. I'm not an NHL analyst. I don't read the game by that way. I don't read the game by numbers and um, and all that stuff. So I don't really read about that. I don't really know about numbers about NHL and like, like I know how many goals people have and I know how many pizzas people have and like I know that type of numbers, but I don't know like the lingo around commentating a hockey game. If you guys know what I'm saying, like, you know, you hear like some of the commentators now these days are like the olden days of hockey. Like, oh, Jim, he put the mustard on that one. Like, I don't like I don't really commentate like that. And the way that I commentate when I, when I want to talk on videos, I talk about the stuff that I want to talk about. And obviously that's all right. And uh, that's all right for some of you guys. But some of some of you guys don't really like it for some reason. I don't know why you guys really want me to talk about the game. Or about NHL. It's actually really hard to talk about NHL. Because I record these like two or three days before they're actually supposed to be up. Sometimes. Sometimes I record them on the night that it comes out. And the night that, uh, yeah, the day that it comes out. Around, right now I'm recording this at 3 o'clock a.m. And this is going up at 7 o'clock a.m. today. Like today you guys are watching this. Today I recorded this. And I'm waiting for my new microphone. My new microphone hasn't come. I canceled the one that I ordered off that one website that I told you guys about that I didn't really trust. But uh, I canceled that order. 
and just ordered it off Amazon, which I trust dramatically to actually get my product that I bought. And Amazon's going to ship it pretty much like a little bit quicker than the actual website that I ordered it from. So, so that's a that's really good. I'm going to pass this up to Crosby over here, and then Crosby's going to pass it back to me, and then uh, I was going to pass it to Castle to do one of those. Crosby passes it to Milk, and then Milk passes it to whatever his name is. Kessel, that's it. <laughs> um, but anyways, so I'm waiting for my new microphone to come. Um, you guys probably don't hear the, basically the, the humming noise I was complaining about. Because I do pretty much really good editing on my audio. So you guys don't hear it, but I do hear it and it pisses me off. And I want to get a better microphone. I wanted to get a better microphone a couple months after I got this one. Like after this one, I was like, okay, this is just going to be a microphone that I used for like five, six months. Then I'm going to buy a new one. I used it for like almost two years now. Um, so it's been it's been quite a while. And also, I want to ask you guys a question. Since uh, Christmas was this past Friday, when I actually uploaded an episode or a video on Friday, and um, you guys really loved that episode. And uh, so I want to ask you guys. What did you guys get for Christmas? And uh, did you guys do anything for Christmas? Like go see your family and all that stuff? Of course you guys went to go see your family. It's one of the traditions that everybody does. They go see their family for Christmas. But I mean like what did you guys get for Christmas? What what presents were you hoping for? And what presents did you get? Tell me in the comments below because I will love to know. Don't worry I'm going to tell you guys what I got. Um, Just in a couple minutes here. So, what I got was, what I mostly get from my parents now is money. Because when I got, when I get to the, when you get to this age, your parents just really give you money because they don't really know what to buy you. Um, anyways, but, um, yeah, so what I got is I got, I got body wash. I always need body wash. You always need body wash. Um, deodorant, uh, socks, underwear, pajamas. Um, I got new sweatpants. I got new shirts and all that stuff and I didn't really get I really get anything when I want something I just go out and buy it myself and um so if I really want something like game like a game or anything I just go out and just buy it I just literally would just go out and buy it that's what I just do I don't I don't wait until somebody buys it for me I sh really should because games are expensive they're about 90 bucks which is ridiculous but uh, I know deals like come on sale and all that stuff for like Xbox. You can get like 50% off or 25% off or something like that. That's when I usually, that's when I want to buy games. But I never have an opportunity to actually buy the games because the games that are on sale I already bought. So it doesn't really matter if they're on sale or not. Because I pre-order pretty much almost every single new game. I almost ever have every single new game of 2015 already. Like, I got Halo 5 at the day it got out, um, Call of Duty Black Ops 3, NHL 16, uh, Rainbow Six Siege, and uh, I got that a couple days. No, I got it on the night that it came out, actually. I didn't pre-order it, but I got it the night that it came out. So, it was pretty good, and uh, I still play that game a lot. And um, I got, what else did I get? I forget, I forget. I forget what games I get, guys. I just buy games, and they're downloaded, and I play them for, like, a week, and I stop playing them. That's how it really works out for me. And uh, it kind of sucks that I can't just go back and play those games. And um, But anyways, continue on what I got for Christmas. And I'm going to try to explain to you guys. You know, like, um, okay, as a kid, you always wanted this one toy. You always wanted this one toy, and you just couldn't get it. Like, you just, like, you got it for Christmas, and you're all excited and stuff. But now, like, as an adult, and as, like, um, I don't know, I'm 22 years old, and, um, I, now I want, all I want for Christmas now is money, socks, and underwear. That's all I want for Christmas. That's literally just all I want for Christmas. It's just socks, underwear, and money. That's, all, that's really just what I want for Christmas. And you guys will get to this point where I am, where you'll realize that you have to buy everything. You have to buy like deodorant and body wash. And of course that's the essentials and, and toothbrush and toothpaste. And that's just the essentials that you usually buy throughout the month. And um, But you'll start to realize buying new socks and buying new underwear gets really, really expensive. And, um, and it gets really expensive for those things that you actually need. And you get excited at Christmas because you got new socks and underwear and you don't have to spend any money to get new socks and underwear. It's amazing. 
But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure you guys smash the like button. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't. My name is Perez, and I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Peace out.